Hey, what's up guys, it's John Cassidy here, and today we are checking out a mayor. This was my first time in a mayor, and uh, I thought this video would be pretty cool for other people who haven't went to mayor before, because it's actually a really nice store, and a lot nicer than Walmart, and I was quite surprised by my visit. So, coming up along here, um, the first thing we'll see is the fruit, and uh, I did notice that they had a really nice produce section, and um, the whole grocery section overall was very nice and uh, I was impressed by that and uh, it just looks a lot better quality than uh, Walmart's fruit and vegetables a lot brighter and cleaner looking so and then uh, moving along down here we'll see a little bit more of the produce section and then coming along here, along here is the uh, frozen section And then up here is the famous wine area that all the mayors have. They have a real nice alcohol and wine section that you don't see in other grocery stores. So that was definitely nice. And then up here is uh, the pet section. There's uh, quite a selection of pet stuff. A lot bigger than uh, Walmart's pet section. More of the pet section. And one of the things I noticed is a few different employees had seen me filming and no one said anything so I thought that was really cool that uh, they don't really care about filming in this store because I guess it's a nicer store and um, not like Kmart or Dead Malls where they don't like people filming it because it looks bad but Mayor looks good so I guess they don't mind filming so definitely an interesting theory. Here's the automotive section, sporting goods section. Sporting goods section. And then uh, one of the things I wanted to check out is I really like Walmart's uh, electronics section, even though some of it's like crappier stuff, they have a really nice selection, I think. So um, I wanted to check out the electronics section at the mayor, and uh, it actually seems a little smaller than Walmart's, and um, it was quite picked over, I thought. So that was one of the only concerns I seen at the mayor, was the electronics was definitely picked. And I didn't see a camera section, I don't believe, at this mayor, which was odd because that's one of my favorite things at the Walmart is the camera section. Up here is the uh, gaming section. You got your uh, Nintendo, Xbox, and PS4 stuff. Looks quite similar to the Walmart's layout of that. And then over here is like I was talking about, these are all the phone cases and stuff, and just look how picked over it is. It was very odd to see that um, in a store, so. 
I don't know if maybe it was just because of the virus or the coronavirus pandemic causing short stock, but definitely interesting. Here's the toy section. They had a pretty big toy selection. Here's the grills and the like outdoor patio section, I guess. Here is uh, where the pharmacy is. I didn't get a real good view of the pharmacy because there was a lot of people in there and I didn't want to get yelled at. So moving along down to the front of the store here. Coming up here, this was actually one of my favorite sections of the store, is this glass facade they have above like the registers. A lot of the newer mayors that were remodeled, or like older stores that were remodeled, they took out that glass facade. And I think it was cool that this mayor kept it. And this was actually one of the oldest mayors in the Northeast Ohio area. So it's um, around 25 to 35 years old from what an employee told me. So that's definitely an interesting fact. And you can see it's almost like an industrial look with the um, glass. It almost looks like an old factory. And I really thought that was interesting. So over here is uh, some of the clothing. They definitely had much nicer clothing than Walmart, I thought, too. Um, you know, more higher class clothing, almost like what you'd get at a JCPenney or a Sears compared to like your basic clothing. And it took up a good section of the store. Notice they had real nice price check stations all throughout the store also. Nice little touch. The shoes, that was also impressive. They even had some name brand shoes. Over here is like some of the women's clothing. And some other uh, clothes, summer items. And now we're gonna be making our way back to the front where we started. There's the uh, produce section and grocery section again. And overall, like I said, I was impressed with my visit. I really like Mayer. I hope they um, move into my area, um, like Youngstown, Warren, Ohio. And um, it'll be definitely interesting. So I want to thank you all for watching. Please leave a like, share, and subscribe. And um, if you guys like this kind of videos, please let me know in the comments. And um, thank you for watching, everyone.